Good evening, everyone. Tonight we're reading Words and Your Heart by Kate Jane Neal. In honor of Valentine's Day next week and also February just so happens to be Heart Month. This book is about your heart. That little bit inside of you that makes you, you. Will you listen very carefully? Because it's really important. And it might help you be a happier you and the people around you be a happier them. You see, the words that go into your ears can actually affect your heart. That little bit inside of you that makes you, you. Your words can do amazing things. They can describe things if they are big or if they are little. They can explain stuff so you understand that it goes whiz and whoosh and boom. Or even spin and tinkle and ping. I imagine. <laughs> words can make you happy and words can make you want to sing. But sometimes words can make us cry. We all know what sort of words those are. You see, sometimes words can be like a deadly arrow that can pierce someone's heart. The little bit inside of them that makes them them. Some words can really hurt. Words have power. Your words can actually change the way someone's heart feels. If someone feels sad, your words can cheer them up. If someone feels weak, your words can help them feel stronger. If someone wants to give up, your words can help them keep going. Your words can make them giggle, make them grin, make them laugh out loud and roll around. Hi, sweet boy. Do you get it? Your words are amazing and powerful. You don't get it yet, sweet boy. <laughs> you do. <laughs> How about we use our words to look after each other's hearts? the little bit inside of us that makes us, us. Let's try it together and see the difference it makes. Today, somebody's world can be a better place because of you. Thank you. Doesn't that make your heart feel good? Happy Valentine's Day from me and from my sweet boy, Magic. <laughs> what are you doing up there, buddy? <laughs> and from all of us at Bedtime Stories in the Barn, we hope you have a great night. Good night.